Martin Compton on using his native accent in our house. Martin Compton has said he thinks using his native Scottish accent helps make characters appear more charming. The actor, originally from Greenock, is best known for playing the role of Detective Inspector Steve Arnott, who is English, in BBC drama Line of Duty. He regularly disguises his strong accent for the characters he plays on TV, but his latest role, in ITV drama Our House, allows him to use his own accent. The 37-year-old, who plays Bram Lawson, told ITV's Lorraine, when you start a project like that, it's just easier to use your own voice. Our house follows Phi Lawson as she discovers that all of her belongings have been removed from her house and new occupants have moved in. The situation worsens when Phi is unable to contact her estranged husband, Bram, and their children. Compton described the show as a classic ITV thriller, you know suburbia, a bit creepy. He also said he thinks the Scottish accent helps make characters appear more charming. For Bram, on paper he does some terrible terrible things, so we kind of needed to make him charming, and I think the Scottish accent kind of helps with that a wee bit, he said. Speaking about his heritage, Compton said how happy he is to be a part of forthcoming Amazon series The Rig. The show, which is due for release later this year, was filmed entirely in Scotland. He said, it was great to work on something in Scotland with such ambition, so I'm excited for it. Compton revealed that he got his Canadian co-star, Emily Hampshire, hooked on Urn Brew, a Scottish carbonated soft drink, during the filming of the show. She's obsessed with soda, so she's always got a Diet Coke in her hand, so I said look, if you're in Scotland and you've got a can of something in your hand all the time, it really should be an Urn Brew. So I got her one to sip, and she was hooked, he said. Compton is also involved in making a new BBC documentary in Scotland, for which he said he is tentatively learning Gaelic. He told Lorraine, we were talking about where does Gaelic sit in modern Scotland, and then we took it to the BBC, and it really evolved from there. Just going around, meeting as many people as I can.